Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. Well, here we go with another high quality foodie feature for you here on the channel, where this time I'm back on over at Sonic, America's drive-in, to check out what looks to be a tasty little upgrade to their classic bacon cheeseburger. So without further ado, let's get into it. It's the Mesquite Butter Bacon Cheeseburger. And guys, this actually presents pretty nicely. I have to admit, this is definitely feeling stacked, definitely feeling substantial, and I'm really hoping the flavor is gonna deliver on this one. So starting off with what's supposed to be a toasted brioche bun. Admittedly, this looks like their regular burger buns, but let's just pop it and take a look underneath. And it looks like we're beginning with a little bit of shredded lettuce, some grilled onions, a very decent amount of pickles. I have to admit, I'm liking that already. And if you look in the back of it there, it looks like we've got a little bit of barbecue sauce, which is actually a honey barbecue sauce. And as we pan down, you can see the other major players of this burger, starting off with a fairly decent amount of crispy looking bacon, but admittedly, it looks a little on the charred side. And that's mixed in with some more of that honey barbecue sauce. It's all sitting on top of a quarter pound of beef, as you can see here, guys, supposedly seared in a smoky mesquite barbecue butter. And that's what's adding to the overall wetness of this burger, guys, but not bad there. And as you can see, nothing on the bottom except a soaked bottom of the bun actually there. So very lovely situation. And I'm only saying lovely situation without tasting it just yet, because as you can see, this is a very wet burger. The bottom of this bun is soaked right now. So it's already satisfying in that department. This has definitely got some wetness to it. But of course, is it gonna have the flavor? Well guys, let's peep this out and find out. It's the all new mesquite butter bacon cheeseburger here at Sonic. Let's do it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yep, absolutely. Yeah, I'm definitely getting a strong honey barbecue vibe with this one with a little bit of butter coming up on the back end after you're crunching into everything else here, guys. This is actually very, very tasty. And considering the debacle that was the quote unquote ultimate cheesesteaks that I checked out the last time out, this is a major step in the right direction, guys, because the quality so far is so much better than that. Let's go for another bite and I'll give you a close up. This is pretty good. Mm, mm-hmm. Yeah, just as I feared, the bacon is a little on the extra crispy side, almost to the point where it really feels a little burnt, believe it or not, guys. But everything else here is really singing in the flavor department. That honey barbecue action is coming through, the mesquite barbecue sauce, a lovely situation, and there's plenty of pickles, which I'm already a fan of already here, guys. All of that is going into the seared patty itself, which again has that nice buttery back end flavor. And honestly, guys, this is so much better than the last time out that I was here. A very lovely situation with this burger so far. Well, I know this has got some grilled onions on here, guys, because I'm getting some of the flavor, but admittedly also, a little bit of the grilled onions are a little on the burnt side, believe it or not. So I think they're a little extra grilled. Whoever was preparing this obviously went a little extra mile, I think, and kept things on there a little too long. But even still, guys, the quality of what I'm getting here for everything else is really coming together nicely. So I'm not gonna knock it too much for that because the experience is better, but the juiciness of the patty, thanks to that mesquite butter, is a lovely situation. And again, it's a barbecue butter, and you're getting some of that smokiness as well. Let's go for another bite on this one. Mmm, pickles, I love them. They're really good with this. And man, that last bite had a little bit of an extra kick when it comes to the bacon, guys. And that's actually not a good thing because it's a little overcooked in my opinion. But even still, everything else that you're seeing on here does a very nice job of delivering the flavor goods. And again, the mesquite butter action is really coming through on this along with that honey barbecue sauce. I am really digging this so far. And like I said, I'm so glad it's so much of a better experience compared to the last time out. This is a better bacon cheeseburger than I think I've had in a very long time, especially from Sonic. Pretty good. And that's even with the slightly charred bacon on top of it here. Yeah, very lovely situation with this. Thanks to that mesquite butter and the honey barbecue sauce on this burger. It's really elevating the bacon cheeseburger in general and that flavor, like I said, is delivering. So one more bite, we'll close this one out after the rating. But thank God this was so good today, guys, because I had my hopes up for it and I'm glad it's virtually satisfied. Virtually, I'll explain in a minute. Well, this would have been almost the perfect bacon cheeseburger eating action over here at Sonic today. Had the bacon itself been a little bit less crispy, guys, it really is a little on the burnt side. And as I'm trying to go around here for you so you can see everything that I'm looking at, I think what I got was the tail end of the grilled onions and that bacon because everything else is really moving nicely with this in the flavor department. The other stuff there, like I said, a little too overcharged for my liking, but even still a lovely situation compared to the last time out. Like I keep saying, this is so much better. Well, I gotta say, it really does take a super lackluster experience to physically show me throwing something away on camera the way that I did. And considering the experience I had the last time out with the quote unquote ultimate cheesesteak here at Sonic, it was really warranted because if you saw that review, and again, you can find it in the upper right hand corner of your display, guys, it was a no bueno situation that completely deserved it. But like many of you, I love a good redemption story. So personally for me, this absolutely redeemed Sonic, at least for the time being, because this was a very good outing this time out. But considering what I reviewed today, the quality was definitely up there, with the exception of the bacon and the grilled onions, like I mentioned earlier, just a little overcharged for my liking. 
So with that said, I'm gonna have to give the all new Mesquite Butter Bacon Cheeseburger here at Sonic a pretty solid 8.2 out of 10. And I'm giving it the point two strictly because of the amount of barbecue butter in that, guys. It was a very wet cheeseburger, and I have to admit that really added the extra moisture that I needed on top of the other flavors of that honey barbecue sauce. Just a lovely combination with that, especially with the pickles, guys. That was really the highlight for me on top of everything else. A decent amount of them. And admittedly, I have to say, this latest burger over here at Sonic really did remind me of the buttery jack somewhat over here that we have in Southern California for Jack in the Box. It's very similar because of the garlic herb butter they use there. So I'm loving the fact that Sonic is kind of emulating a little bit of that, but with a little bit of a barbecue flair. Definitely solid. All right, so I got to ask you, how delicious did this burger look to you right now? Drop some comments down below. How did this actually appeal to you overall? Does this actually want to get you to jump on over to Sonic to give it a go? And if you do give it a shot, is there anything you're going to add extra to maybe kick it up even further? Maybe make it a double? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why you stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Nice job on this one, Sonic, but let's keep that trend moving for my next review, please. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews, but just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's going to recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.